So when it comes to setting up your merchandise display, you want to make sure you have your shirts in body molds or your hoodies in body molds and maybe hang in some, you know, posters up there or uh, hats or whatnot. But I got these body molds. You can get them off Amazon.com. I'll put a link to them where you can order these so you can display your merch right. Um, you want to make sure you have those up there. Um, some venues, you know, you won't be able to display and set up your poles. I have this um, these poles called Ultimate Poles. I'll put a link in here as well too um, just so you can set up a nice display with your banner behind you whether that's your album cover or your logo and you normally have this at a festival or at a bar wherever you're playing a show you have a really nice display so people know where you are and it looks good you've got lights up there so that you can you know light up the merch especially when it comes to clubs and bars or sometimes wherever when it gets dark at night at the festivals um, just so that they can see your merch and they know where you are and then it just looks sick it looks pro so let me just go over this one more time you want to have some poles the company um, that I ordered my poles one of them is called ultimate poles display poles but you can get any um, lighting poles or whatnot anything that has the the two poles and then the pole that go or sorry the two stands and then the pole that goes across so that you can hang your banner and you just pick up some uh, red clips from like Home Depot or on Amazon or something like that so that you can clip your banner to it and then you can hang your shirt molds with some some, uh, some hangers or whatnot. You can get any hangers from any store. Hang your shirts. Have a poster up there or your hoodies or whatnot. And then plug in some lights. You're going to need an extension cord, of course. Sounds like a lot of stuff, but it's really important to have all these things when you're going to a festival to make sure you have a really nice display to set you apart from the other bands, you know? You know, there's been shows sometimes I don't fly with my poles all the time anymore or whatnot, um, especially if I'm, I'm headlining and it just depends on the event because sometimes I just want to bring more merch than I want to bring, uh, than I want to bring all the poles and the details. But if I'm on tour, or I'm doing a big festival, I make sure that I have the display looking awesome because I want to move as much merch as I possibly can and I want it to be easy for people to find me because you could be at a big event or whatnot and then people just can't find you, just don't know where you are. But if you can stand out and you've got your logo and it's the same logo that maybe you had in your show because if you're using video projections in your show, which I hope you are, so that you can have your, your logo and your images and then you can continue to have your brand over and over and then people start to associate your brand from the show oh I remember seeing that logo that image oh there it is right there or, or maybe during the show you were like hey here's a, a free CD you can get these at our merchandise table look for this shirt toss it out to the crowd and then hopefully people find you and again you know if people sometimes buy shirts at the show or a hoodie and they start wearing it right away and guess what happens when people start wearing stuff right away they're like oh that's sick where, where did you get that oh I got that way over there and if you've got that only on your table when people get to it and it's not up on the banner it's going to be harder for people to find you so that's why it's really important to invest in getting body molds and making your display look really awesome again it will pay back tenfold for investing in all this stuff. I know, again, it might seem a lot, but you just check off each item and you build and you build and you build. I don't want you to go into debt for this stuff, but these are certain things that you want to get in place to set you apart from the other bands.